Hey there YouTube, this is Mr. Lubufu and I'm here with another sponsored opening and giveaway from MagicOnABudget.com uh, Those of you longtime viewers of my channel have noticed that they've been around for a long time and they're one of the great best places online to get uh, to get great Magic the Gathering cards and uh, they have cheap shipping. So, uh, you'll be entered into the contest to win two packs of Gate Crash once the set comes out. Sponsored by Magic on a Budget. Um, at the end of this video so go ahead and enjoy the opening and then uh, it's really easy to enter so to begin with they actually w asked me if there were any cards that I was looking for in particular and I casually mentioned that I was making a cube and I sent a few things for my cube so we got a foiled withered wedge wrench which is one of those cool cards and this is the time shifted one as well so it's pretty sick a foil sphinx of Uthun also known as factor fiction sphinx great blue finisher We've got a card that I really, really like in cube because there's all sorts of fun combo decks that this card is good in. Regrowth. I had one when I first started. I didn't know what it was. Now I'm very, very glad to get one of these. Another card that I actually really need for cube that I've been unable to acquire before. Flame Tongue Kabu. Uh, we also have what looks to be a uh, Japanese or Chinese um, Geist Honored Monk. This card, I actually opened it in my last Innistrad draft I did, and it's a, it's a limited bomb. And then we have a Hall of the Bandit Lord. So it comes into play tapped, but you can pay three life, add one mana. If uh, the mana is spent on a creature, it has haste. So that's pretty cool. Definitely a good EDH card as well. And they also sent two packs of Return to Ravnica, one pack of Absent Restored, and one pack of M13. So let's go ahead and start with this Return to Ravnica back. Return to Ravnica is almost done. Gate Crash comes out this this week, so, or the pre-release is this week, so that should be a fun set. But not the last we're going to see out of this set at all, because it comes back. No foil, so we have a Rhino token in the forest. I'm going to just flip through the commons, just so you get to see them, but you don't have to spend time with me reading them. I'm just gonna go through it. Goblet Electromancer are good in Modern Storm. Dead Ruffler is really good as well. Nightlight and Fire is another solid common. Our first uncommon is Blister Coil Weird. Our second is a Syncopate. Our third is a Rakdos Rage Mutt. And our rare is a Guild Feud. Certainly one of the more fun enchantments to uh to open up that's rare. I mean it's better than Search the City, that's for certain. Uh, next, let's go ahead and open up Avacyn Restored. Those of you longtime viewers know Avacyn Restored has not actually treated me well as a set. Never opened a bonfire. Um, I think I've opened one Cavern of Souls and maybe like one Crater Hoof Behemoth back when it was, you know, not worth much when I needed it. And one Entreat the Angels. So hopefully this goes over well. No foil, but we have a Plains and a not tip or a tip card. We have a Trusted Force Mage, definitely a limited, really good card. Oh, right, I'm just going to flip through the, the comments. Just point out, point out any cards. Avacyn Restored Limited was certainly a very, very interesting format. Um, and look at that. With two scrolls in order. It's pretty funny. Scalding Devil. And a Wandering Wolf. Our first uncommon is Angelic Armaments. Our second is Favorable Winds. Our third is Haven Gold Vampire, and our rare, Descent into Madness. Uh, told you, Absent Restored has is so much. It's so good to me. Uh, M13, on the other hand, I really like opening. I'm not sure why. Do we have a foil? No foil. We have uh, another tip card and a mountain. Just going to again flip through the commons. Unsummon is actually a card I was specifically looking for, oddly enough. Um, it's all sorts of fun things you you find when anytime you open up a core set, there's just value commons and uncommons. Tormented Soul, very interesting. So our first uncommon is Ring of Thune. Our second is Garrick's Pack Leader. Our third is a Jace's Phantasm and our rare Silk Lash Spider. 
definitely a very very powerful card. I've had it in sideboards in a few of my uh, few of my decks that I've built that have been green. And lastly, how about we return to Ravnica? Oh, you see what I did there? <laughs> Silly puns. Um, foil time? Oh, it's foil time. <sighs> Again, probably just gonna flip through the the commons and uncommons. Traitor's Instinct, Rootborn Defenses, which is probably gonna get replaced with Boros Charm in a lot of standard decks. This one's just a fun one just to sc randomly scream out anytime you play it. Search Warrant, Police! Daggerdrome Imp, you build your own Baneslayer. Guildgate. I, I love this card more than I should. I really do. Our first uncommon is Security Blockade. Our second is Liev Sky Knight. Our third is Treasured Find. And our rare is a Carnival Hellsteed. But wait, there's a foil. What is it? It's a foil plane. Look at that. That's pretty. So, there's the pack opening. Now for your chance to win two packs of Gate Crash once the set comes out. It's pretty straightforward. Go ahead and go to magiconabudget.com. There'll be a link down below in the description. And check out um, the their Gate Crash pre-order page. If you look, they'll have every single mythic in Gate Crash that's been spoiled, I believe, at the time of uh, recording. And they have every single one at a cheaper price than Star City Games. So if you're looking for your Aurelia the War Leaders and you want to get cheaper shipping and get it, you know, $3 out of 15 so, you know, one-fifth uh, off, like, that's a great way to go through it. But they also have, you know, uh, your Enter the Infinites are also cheaper, so go ahead, check out the Mythics that they have there. They've also restocked Return to Ravnica and uh, repriced it all, so if you're looking for uh, Return to Ravnica staples at a good price, check them out. It's, it's open... Uh, or it's, you know, it's always there. It's always an option. And to win your packs, all you have to do is, um, while you go ahead and looking through there, take a look at the mythics that are in Return or in Gate Crash, and say the one that you are most excited to play with. I'm not going to say in any particular format, but if there's any one in particular that really stands out to you, or if you see some crazy combo, just go ahead and mention it down below in the comments. I'll randomly pick one winner in the comments below, and you'll win two packs of Gate Crash. Simple enough. It's all thanks to MagicOnABudget.com. So again, check them out. Um, they're always they're always around. They always have great prices, and they're just really friendly to work with as well. Thank you guys all for watching. Rate, comment, and subscribe.